right, man. Preparations, huh? This better look really cool. You know how I am with my face paint. What have I ever let you down? I can't believe you just did that to me. Uh, Let's see here. What do you got? Well, I'm not doing the shirt. I'm just, you know, it's a nice little template, though. It's a nice little fruity shirt you got there. But uh, we're going to try to scare this kid, not to, you know, get him to take you out on a date. It depends what kind of movie are we going to get. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know. That's fucking, that's great. That's great. Oh, my God. The, the things that you can find... I mean, hey man, how, how talented are you with paint anyways? Like, really? Well, I painted the Mona Lisa. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah. It, it turned out to be a big piece of shit, but <laughs> yeah, I did it once. Oh, holy crap! I thought the thing was, like, from the 1800s or something. Yeah. Something. I appreciate that we got all these from fucking Salval on the cheap, but, uh, man, what... It's all fucking bunny foo foo colors up in here. Dickens got them. Oh, that explains a lot. I mean, how about that shrining video, man? That video is that pumps. That got me pumped up. I can't believe like uh, someone would do such a thing and then put it on video and then I don't know, show it to people. That was a that was a good video. Well, looks like we're gonna be doing a little. Thing, you know, man, someday you should think about uh, quitting them cigs. Someday. someday. Moving on to uh, an electro, possibly. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see how that goes. <sighs> Alright. Alright, let's, uh, let's... How about we get a rubber band for my hair? I don't know where I'd even Give find... a cigarette over my hair. Well, I need to ask somewhere, don't I? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's all sparkly and shit, too. Oh, really? That's amazing. Mm. That's nice. I figured you'd like that. Hey, what if a customer comes? Oh, I wouldn't worry about that. I don't know, man. I got some good business the other day. Yeah? Yeah. What'd you get? What'd you sell? You sold something? No. You sold something? Oh. I'm gonna say, if you sold something... You I sold a smile. That's crazy. And, uh, I don't know, they looked at me funny, so I kind of... You sold a smile? Yeah. How much? About five bucks. It's kind of expensive for a smile, don't you think? Yeah, well, uh, I don't run cheap. You don't run to cheap? I don't Jesus. run cheap. You don't run cheap? Yes. Well, you don't really run much at all. No, I don't. Anyway, so... I don't know, man. Uh, you're always you're always in here, like, uh, working real early. Like, why do you have to come in so early? Like, I mean, what I mean, mean? Like, well, I mean, I know the place opens up, you know, at 9. Yeah. But, uh... Why don't you just come in a little later? Well, if I came in later, then the store would not be open. I mean, uh, I, I mean, I'm a busy guy. I, I, I run out a lot. I understand. You do run out a lot. Yeah. You're a very busy guy. I mean, what, what do you do when you, uh, these little jaunts here or there? Oh, that looks, that just looks terrible. Oh. 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 Adapt and overcome. Adapt and overcome. You know how I am with my face paint. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What? I mean, it's part of my image. I go out on the streets and people are like, Hey, man, I really like that Aladdin Sane that you have on your face. And then also, what the fuck is Aladdin Sane, right? Aladdin Sane? You know. You, you know, David Bowie. David Bowie, yes. David Bowie. I feel like I've been here before. Yeah, that was actually earlier on, so, uh... Yeah, just, I mean, if you want me to get back into David Bowie, week. I, I can go on about it. I mean, did you know about his new CD? The next day? Yes. I mean, I know it's kind of, you know, last year, but, man, it's a good CD. It is a good CD. Yeah. You're so 2008, and I'm so 2000 and late, aren't I? Oh, that was so 2000 yesterday. I don't know what you're saying. Oh, man, this better look cool. Yeah, it's Dickens cool. is going to definitely want a picture of this. Yeah, 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 he is. He always finds a, a liking to my face paint. No, oh, because he has to. I don't know if he does, but, you know, he, he, he kind of is forced to because, you know, when your foster father kind of gave up on you, uh, you know, your uncle came into the picture and was like, 
oh man, I guess I gotta take care of this kid, you know? And then, uh, you know, and then he did. So, I mean, that was really nice of him. But, uh, hey, in your spare time, do you ever, like, make fun of Dickens' voice? Huh? Huh? No. No, I'll never do so. Yeah, there's no Dickens here right now. So, why don't you uh, give me a little. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, okay. Get a little laugh out of there. You know, I'm about to have the fight of my life. Yeah, so you need to you need to really start focusing up and That's the th point th of the think about the fight. That's the point of the painting. Well, I'm painting. You're just sitting there. You need to you need to think about everything that this jerk's done to you, man. He's done a lot. Yeah, he has done a lot. And you're just you know you're sick and tired of just letting it happen, right? Yeah. So now is the time to fucking really. Really get serious and fucking say to him, hey, hey man, I'm not gonna take your shit anymore. And if it comes down to it, well, I got Jack Johnson and Tim O'Leary waiting for you right here, buddy. What's that from? Well, oh, that's from Anchor Man, but. Oh, I never saw it. What? You never saw, you never saw Anchor Man? Yeah. Man, that fucking figures. I don't really watch the news. Asshole. What? Asshole. Oh, you know, I'm, I'm actually not. I'm a really nice guy. Oh. What? This no. guy came in here the other day and asked for a movie. I told him to get out. I think that's the opposite. That's that's not. That's the opposite of what nice means. A girl came in here the other day, looking for a comic book. I brought her into Dickens' office. Was, and what? And then what? <laughs> I don't kiss and tell, actually. So. Uh, I see. Yeah. And what about you? I've never seen you with a girl, anyway, so... Uh... Well, I'm saving myself for this, especially for somebody. <laughs> what are you... What are you... <laughs> yeah. Have you ever been with a girl? Yeah, I'm with girls all the time. Phys ed, remember? You ever kiss a girl? Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I also don't kiss until now. Oh. Except for right now. Oh. So. What's her name? Was it Phyllis? I thought it was. I'm pretty sure it's Nanya. Uh, I thought it was Phyllis, so. Oh, by the way, she called earlier. Phyllis called? We had f called who? The phone. What phone? We have a phone here. What? Yeah. When did that start? It's in Dickens' office. Alright. She, uh. Phyllis called? Yeah. She was asking about you. Oh. Did she say anything specific? Um, yeah. She's wondering uh, when you take her up on that date. I don't recall ever saying that I would take her out on a date. Well, I thought we just had a little quiet affair. What? What? I had nothing. I'm just... Oh, God. I'm just doing a bit. Oh, well, life's all about bits, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. You got bits? You got bits? We all got bits. Bits of chicken. Hmm. I gotta tell you something right now. If you need just a delicious, relaxing smoke, I would recommend L and M cigarettes. They're delicious. Everything's good. L and M, love in Meadville. You know, I'm really love in. Meadville. I'm really quenched right now. You're quenched. Yes. What do you mean by that? I would. I am dying for a thirst. Oh, see, quenched means you don't have the thirst. Quen when your thirst is quenched, that means... You know, I, you know, oh, you think you're so smart, don't you? Yeah. I did get an 1100 on my SATs, after all. You know, I am looking for a delicious so Arizona that, herbal tonic. That's my tonic. Get out of here with that. Oh, you mind if I have some? Yeah, dude. You got fucking paint on it. Mm. Oh, that is so good, though. That is so good. Arizona <laughs> herbal tonic. It is the best. All right, that's enough. How's this looking? Oh, really good. Just wonderful. Yeah. I better be serious. Yeah, I'm, I'm being serious. Oh, though. man, my neck. Oh, yeah, yeah. Life's pretty tough. Dickens gives the best neck ropes. Anyway. What? He gives the best neck rubs? Oh, yeah. Oh, I see. The you, plot thickens. Did you know that Dickens was married once? No. Dickens. Yeah. He was married. To who? Ah, God, what was her name? 
Uh, I actually, it's been so long. They were dating, and then uh, thought, uh, all right, let's uh, let's go to Vegas. Let's go to Vegas and uh, get married on one of those uh, you know cheap chapels, because. You know, Dickens is all about saving his money. Really well, nice. all, well, yeah, and he is all about Vegas, too. I mean, too, you, you I don't want to... I mean, if he's put in front of a freaking table, man, he, he gambles like a, a bitch. Like a mother bitch. He's... Like a mother bitch. Yeah, man. He His gambling... He has kind of a problem with gambling. Uh, I mean, uh, why don't you uh, ask him to gamble sometimes? Maybe you guys could uh, get along for once. Go to fucking first battle downs or some shit. Yeah. But, uh, they got married. I and, didn't know he liked to gamble. Oh, yeah, he, yeah. He's, uh, he's a big gambler. Uh... He brought his girlfriend out to gambling. They got married right after. Uh, he divorced her the next day. He divorced her? Yes. He thought it was the biggest mistake of his life because she, she asked for breakfast. Well, that seems... You telling the truth right now? Yes. That seems a little extreme. Well, and... Uh, it was Oh, yeah. She did want to move. He said he likes it in Meadville. She said she wants to move up in the mountains. He said there's no way in hell that's ever happening. Well, yeah, with all the bears. Yeah, dude. Mountain bears all over the place. Oh, my God, I know. Uh, so, I mean, uh, I, I'm, I'm fine with bears myself. I don't have any problem with bears personally. Yeah. But I wouldn't want to live among them. Well, you know, I, as as far as I've heard, and uh, I don't know, I wouldn't talk about it much around Dickens, but uh, when they got divorced, she moved up in the mountains, and... Uh, it was in the paper, dude. She got ripped apart. No shit. She got eaten by them freaking bears. Do you think? Do you think Dickens holds a grudge against the bears because, uh, yeah, maybe he divorced her, but you know, I mean, he he did say that he's gonna spend the rest of his life with her, and that's gonna mean something. But he was probably just like, you're you're gonna get fucking eaten by them bears. Yeah. Why? What are you doing? And that's her. And she's fault. like, and she's like, well, I have to explain myself to you anybody, guy. Yeah. It's like fine. Move up into the mountains and fucking get eaten by bears. She got eaten. That's, that sucks. They found her head in uh, the mother bear's lair. What? Yeah. Holy shit. The babies were sleeping in her guts. Oh. Why does he ever talk about this stuff? I mean, jeez. It's, it's, it's a hard spot in his heart. I always thought he was kind of a dick, you know, but man, that's that's rough stuff. I mean, you know, you should talk about that. Oh, I, I, it's always just, I, I see probably, up. you probably do not want to bring that up around him. He, he I'm just saying, well, hey, you know. Everyone needs to talk about stuff every so often, man, you know? Yeah. Well, I mean, maybe maybe you should just say something once to him and just uh, see how it goes, you know? Get to have a meaningful conversation. Yeah. And, uh, That's what I was thinking. He's always up for uh, talking about... Uh, and ask him how much money he has. Uh, he always likes to talk about how, how much money he has. I mean... Oh, and another thing is, too... Um, uh, Talk about your love of bears, man. Uh, he, he really likes to hear about them. I don't actually love bears. Well, he likes to hear that uh, bears are nice. He gets a kick out of that. I think I think you're trying to do a thing right now. Like what? You're trying to get me in trouble. No! No, I'm not. I'm just trying to think of a way to, you know, make this life livable for myself, you know, and if I'm here and I'm working, fucking, you know, I fucking hate it because I don't make any goddamn money, but... Um, How much money do you make? Ah, two percent of the gross sales. <laughs> really? I make five bucks an hour. What? Yeah. So you just give money every day? Yeah. Oh man, that's that's fucking intense. Five bucks though, man. And if I ever want to go out and get something, I get that money right away. Foster kids do get all the sympathy. Well, that's what happens whenever your your dad's a Mexican and your mom's a, a runaway Canadian. Right, right. But but you're not actually Canadian. No, I am. Not really? I'm, yes, I am. Is that is that what your uncle told you? Yes. Actually, he's German. Yeah. yeah. yeah he's... I don't know what's up with the lotion, though, at all. I mean, that just that kind of bugs me. What, the lotion? Yeah. Well, you told me all about the lotion. He comes from a long line of fucking lotion makers from Bavaria. Oh, God. Like, you know how we drink these herbal tonics? Well, he made, like, not a lotion tonic, because that sounds ridiculous, but... But they make like lotions and salves. That explains the picture in his, his office. Lotions and salves that you rub into your skin. So like, you know, we ingest caffeine, but they would put caffeine in the lotion and stuff. And like different herbs and things to and it would get Maybe I should use up some of that lotion whenever I go fight. Sounds like a good idea. 
Well, yeah, that video. Remember, you fucking you put on some of that lotion. There was like jumping jacks nonstop, man. You should go look through his family files, man. You should uh, see some of them pictures. They're pretty uh, crazy. His uh, great grandfather actually uh, used to give uh, lotion in uh, Germany back in the forties. He used to give out lotion during WW two. Yeah, man. Did you get it? Yeah. In Germany, of course. Yeah. Uh, see some dry skin. It's like, ah, here you go. Yeah. And uh, it's the uh, see Kyle and all that lotion right? de la Roche. The thing's been. I, He's, you know, I I find the lotion thing kind of ridiculous, but uh, I well, guess that's how his family fucking made money, you know. Yeah, La Roche, I think, is uh, native German for the lotion. So, uh, just rest easy. Uh, this is very close awkward. your eyes, please. Oh no. Oh no. On the way that I had anticipated. Mm. Mm -hmm. But it's nice. Let's just a little mix here. Oh, yeah. It's going to take me a while to open my eyes, isn't it? No, no, you're just fine, just fine, 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 fine. Oh, God. Oh, my neck is cramping. Oh. I, I feel like I want to go mustard out. in there. I got to go around the town, man. I really do. Like, uh, I haven't been stuck in this comic book shop for this long. I gotta, I gotta go out and get something. What are you like, Papa John, just walking around, fucking aimlessly all day? I gotta, I gotta get something. Oh, that is gonna be, oh, that is just gonna be a nice color. Yeah, go ahead and close your eyes. Yeah, that's just gonna look great. Yeah, that is nice. You see, I'm already pumped up for the fight. I'm already wearing my wrestling gear. Your wrestling gear. Yeah. Ultimate Warrior T-shirt. Daniel Bryan wristbands in John Cena, no, no, John Cena no, jorts. No, John Cena no. jorts. I only put on the shorts. I'm I'm usually in pants. John I, Cena jorts. I did not want to put these on. I just had to. Why did you have to? These were my only shorts. Why do you need shorts? It's fucking February. Because I feel like it. I see. Open your eyes. Uh, yeah, my neck is cramping. Uh, I am. I don't even know why the fuck I'm doing this for you, man. Why? Well, this fucking you just kind of been a dick all week. I have. Yeah. Oh my god! What about you? What about me, dude? Close eye. You don't do anything around here. Open eye. I don't do anything around here? Nope. You're the fucking town walker. You're the, you're the fucking one of those towny walkers, man. And, uh... I'll tell you what, though. You do get a nice sleep. You do get a nice sleep? Yeah, I get I get some nice sleep around here. Around here? What do you yeah. mean around here? I do live here. What? <laughs> you don't live. They Excuse do. Me. My futon's right back there. Is that what that is? Yeah! You fucking live here? Yes! How are you late every day? I I get up about 7 o'clock in the morning, take a shower, get a nice cup of coffee, then I go around my, my business around town. So what you're trying to tell me is... I leave about like 8.30. The store opens at 9! <laughs> well, I have some stuff to do. Oh. What do you think those clothes are over there? Those are my... I thought they were for sale. I thought we were like an all-purpose... Nope, those are my clothes. Now we're going down to the nitty gritty. Great find at Salville, though. Is this the same fucking size? Yeah, that'd be right. My face is feeling dry. Uh. Well, if your face is feeling dry, a little lotion de la Roche would probably help you out right there. Man, this is probably the best color that I've ever created, by the way. It looks great. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. What? Fuck your fucking face. Ah! Uh. This is a low budget television show. You fucking stop moving! <laughs> I'm sorry. I still feel like they're brownies. 
Dude. <laughs> I'm sorry. Stop baking brownies when I'm standing right here. Close your eye. Relax. Zen. Right. I gotta tell you that this just looks... It just looks terrible. Just god awful. Really? Oh yeah. It's just... It's just the biggest piece of shit work I've ever done. That just makes me feel so much better. Well, it's about as shitty as your farts, so... Dude, my bully is gonna laugh at me when he sees me. Well, see, it's not about... Paint isn't what intimidates. You know, I should have just let Dickens do my paint again. He never does paint. Oh, yes, he does. He's an artist. He doesn't do your paint. Let's see what we got going on here. How much fucking hair do you have? Oh, dude, you're messing up my paint. Don't mess up your paint. You just have some... <sighs> ah! There we go. That'll... See? That'll help. Now I can do some more purple, too. Ah. Uh... Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, oh, Krishna, Krishna. Oh, man. I'm going to be sore for this fight. Ugh. Well, hopefully it's just over really fast and just fucking intimidate him. <laughs> oh, I'm pretty so sure it will be. Well, yeah, that's the, that's what we're going for, right? Oh, yeah, definitely. One and done, right? One and done. A quick, easy fight. Yep. And I'm going to get out there and win it. Minute to win it. Minute to win it. Guy Raffaelli. What was that guy? That fucking guy? I have no idea. I, fucking, I never was, He was a chef or something, and then he was all of a sudden... The, the fucking guy that... His name's the, Guy. Yeah, guy, guy, fucking Fieri, he, guy Fieri. He did the dine, dine-in shows. Yeah, and then all of a sudden he was supposed to minute to win. I'm like, what the fuck is this? You know. All right, let's see what else we got here. What else can we do? What else can we do? You sure, this is good. Oh, dude, it looks, dude, it looks fucking amazing. I can't wait till the I finally just meet that boy. It's gonna be a nice fight. Yeah. A nice brutal battle. Well, I'll make sure to bring the knife. No, you don't. Why? No. What are you doing? Well, I, I did the the warrior. Now, now we need to expand and make it your own, huh? We're doing good. I feel myself getting hemorrhoids just sitting here. Well, if you weren't such a fucking Jewy, you wouldn't get so many hemorrhoids. I don't. I heard that's what that's like a thing with Jews. Is like they I'm get, not Jewish. They get hemorrhoids a lot. That must be you. I saw you in here the other day wearing that yarmulke. Yeah, that's how I know. That's how I know. What was up with that, anyways? I had hemorrhoids. Apparently, if you put on a yarmulke. It heals your hemorrhoids, and that's why they have yarmulkes. It's still poured off. <laughs> <laughs> Can you not do that right in I'm my face? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Apparently, that's why they have the yarmulkes. To uh, ward off hemorrhoids. Because the original uh, Yiddish word for a hemorrhoid, you know, which is, you know, the fucking growth word. On your asshole is a chamaka, and the the ya means without. So uh, ya macha without hemorrhoids. So. I watched this small featurette on Gold Dust. He did a WWE inbox. Yeah. I said, how long does it take to put on your Face paint. He said, "That's a really good question." He said, uh, "Well, in the old days, it only took him about ten minutes to to put on his paint." 
but um, with the the new school gold dust, it takes them a little bit longer, about 35 minutes each time, because it's you know it's just gotten so involved. You know what I mean? And uh, I think we got a little bit of echo in the as well. You know, I bet that, that boy is probably just standing out there. Well, I'm sure that he is. I mean, what, what time did he say to be there? One o'clock? Yeah. What time is it now? It's like fucking 1240 or something. I don't know. He might be there. He's one o'clock. We're outside the shop, right? Yeah. So, we got time. In the snow, of course. Well, fucking, of course it's in the snow because it's February. That's, that's why it's in the snow. This fucking war paint on. I know this from experience because I was in the service. With this war paint, you will be intimidating, and this bully isn't gonna have any idea what the fuck. When were you in the service? Uh, from fucking 2004 to 2011. You were in high school, weren't you? Yeah. Well, it was like a correspondence program. A guy had a pen pal that was in the service. And so you were in the service by talking to a pen pal? Yeah, yeah, I got a, like a certificate of, uh, you know, pen pal authenticity. And uh, I, had, I had achieved a honorable rank of private first class in the system. So. Oh dear lord. No need to worry, I know exactly what I'm going to do. He would also always ask me for like, photos and stuff. Cause oh, like he, oh, yeah, he, really? he, he, yeah, well, like a big part of it was physical fitness, and he wanted, always wanted me to like send him pictures of like, here's what I look like this week, as opposed to like next week. So I'd like send him pictures of my underwear. Like, oh, you'd send him pictures of you in your underwear. Huh? Well, yeah, because like yeah, I understand yeah. completely. Yeah, because he's like, you know, we gotta make sure that you know you're, you know, staying active and. Oh everything. yeah, he's alone. You know, he's not alone. He's with a whole bunch of other guys. Yeah, yeah. Take showers all together. Yeah. yeah. Look yeah. at that. Put that picture of you up on the wall. Be like, hey, that. Well, us maybe, up I hope so, because that's cool. Because it, like, you know, he shows buddies like, hey, look at this guy. Like, I'm writing, man. He's like trying to do something with his life. It's really cool. Right? Yeah, that sounds about right. So I got to be so good at this makeup. Oh. Okay. Yeah. He always was like, put on some war paint. You know, so you can, like act like you're. You know, I'm like, yeah, cool, I don't know how to do warping. And then he was like, well, first you need purple, obviously, and, uh... So he, he ran out of, uh, he ran out of Playboy, didn't he? He went, uh, did a what? He ran out of Playboy? He rented a Playboy? He ran out of Playboy, didn't he? Playboy? Yeah. You mean the magazine with girly pictures? Yeah, he must not have one. Feeling a little bit lonely? I don't know what you Wanting a picture of, uh, a young man in his underwear? Why would he substitute a playboy for a young man in his underwear? Well, I don't know. Maybe he just, uh, you know, pumped him up for his duties. Are you, uh, are you trying to insinuate something? The United States military is nothing to joke about. <laughs> well, uh, I don't know, but this guy, just the way it just sounds. Yeah, I'll tell you this. Done? Almost. Got one more outline and one more coloring in to do. He's got plenty of time. Look, you can't rush war, okay? You can't rush war. Okay. Once you purse those little lips out for me, that's nice.
Porsche. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is nice. Fishing off with the, the glitter blue, yellow, black. <coughs> oh, excuse me, I just got a little sores. Shave this morning? Yeah. I did a shitty job. I'm in a hurry. Oh, yeah. I'm a busy guy. I'm sure. Done. I've got to get a picture of you. Uh, yeah. Why? Just to send him my buddy. Oh God. Uh, I don't think that's a good he's idea. He's in Afghanistan. He's very low. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, he hasn't seen his life partner. Oh, life partner. Yeah. No wife or? I don't know. I never asked. I mean, uh, it's, a, it's a new, it's a new world, and don't ask, don't tell, or something, right? Yeah. Just, uh, just kind of let it be, whatever. Uh huh. Hey man, you ever watch cartoons? Yeah, I love cartoons. You ever watch the uh, Glazed Donut cartoon? Glazed Donut? Dude, fucking A. Wait, wait, I, I do a pretty good Glazed Donut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Glazed Donut. I feel like I do a pretty good Glazed Donut, though. Uh, donut balls. <laughs> See? Donut balls. See, I, I'm pretty good at it. Hmm. Yes. It's pretty uh, nice. I got a good one. Uh, <clears throat> <laughs> wow, I haven't done this in a while. Uh, I'd feel glum too if I was in a pile of donut balls. Well, who's that supposed to be? It's supposed to be French Claire. I'm not sure that's what French Claire even sounds like. Uh, how long, Glaze Donut? I think we're done. Yeah. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, uh, yeah. That looks pretty good. Yeah, it does. All right, man. So, look, man. Are you ready for this? Uh, yeah. Actually, I don't think I, I am really. What do you mean? It's. I don't think. It's I'm the gonna, day of. I don't it's the think time I'm set. You know, actually, I don't think I'm gonna do it. Uh, you got your fucking face yeah, paint on. Yeah, you got the yeah, war yeah, paint. It was a fun time, but uh, I don't think I'm. I don't think. Listen here, you jack off. You're gonna fight this fucking guy. Uh, I didn't spend this whole week fucking catering to your needs just to have you back down now. Uh. <laughs> You will rise up. Uh, you will face the challenge, and in the end, you will become a fucking man. I am a man. You'll be a man when you kick this jerk's ass! You know what? Yeah! Yeah? Yeah! 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 Alright, well, let's All right, do it. Let's...